Hi there, I'm Jessica from UPDF. In today's digital age, the need for efficient file management and sharing has become absolutely paramount. With the increased use of electronic documents and limited space on devices and platforms, the need to be able to compress files is becoming more and more in demand for individuals and organizations. So today I am here to show you how you can compress files using UPDF. Open your PDF file on UPDF, then simply select Save as other from the sidebar and then choose the reduced file size option. There are four compression levels available, maximum, high, medium and low, allowing you to choose the level of compression that suits your needs. After selecting a quality, you can check the file size and click save as to finish the whole process. One of the great features of UPDF is that you can compress PDF files on any of your devices. UPDF supports all Mac, Windows, iOS and Android devices, meaning that you can use the handy features across all of your platforms with ease. We have just demonstrated how to reduce a file size on a MacBook and now I'm going to show you how to reduce file size using an iPhone. Open UPDF on your mobile device, then click the arrow at the top and then reduced file size. Here you have multiple options on how you would like to reduce your file size. And once you have chosen it, you just press reduce. If you have a file in a different format, such as a Word, Excel, JPG file, for example, then UPDF can be used to transform this document into a PDF with a reduced file size. All you need to do is open up UPDF on your Mac or Windows PC and navigate to File, then Create, and then PDF from File, or any other option you would prefer. At last, click Save as Other and then Reduce File Size to compress the file you have created. Since compressing aims to reduce your file size, UPDF provides a solution so you can seamlessly share your files with others. Simply click on the Share this file with others option and you can effortlessly share your compressed PDF with anyone. When sharing, you have two options, share a link or share with others via email. When you're creating a link to share, you can have either a physical link or a QR code which you can share. And you can also choose the expiration time of the link. Similarly, with share with others, you enter the email address of who you would like to share it with and you can write a message and then you can send the link to them directly. By utilizing the split or extract features in UPDF, you can effectively reduce the size of your files. This functionality allows you to take a large document and split it into smaller, more manageable sections. This results in decreased file size without compromising your file integrity. To extract pages using UPDF, go to Organize Pages and then select the number of pages that you would like to extract and then simply press Extract. To split the document by number of pages or by size, click the split icon at the top. I'm going to demonstrate how to split by number of pages. Here I'm going to select by four pages, which means I'm going to make four documents, each with four pages long. UPDF Cloud also offers you another solution to free up space on your device. By seamlessly syncing your PDF files to the cloud, you can very easily store and access your files from anywhere. To access the UPDF cloud, go to the UPDF homepage where you can then find all of the files you have already uploaded to the cloud. If you want to upload another file, simply click upload file and you can upload it straight away to the cloud. You can also create a new folder to help you organize your files within the cloud. In conclusion, UPDF provides an effective solution for compressing your files across all devices. If you found this video useful, please give us a like or leave us a comment if you have any questions in the comment box below. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you can see more tutorials in the future. Download UPDF today to experience the effective compressing tools and the other PDF editing features. Thank you for watching.